Morning, Grey Man. How are you doing? Get off my land. I can see through. I can see you through me <laughs> uh, window. Get off my land. What are you doing? How dare uh, you? I'm no. Who are you? Tom. Who are you? Terrible, terrible. Right, give me shotgun out next time. Um, no, no, <laughs> run away. Right. How, how was Mal? I'm good, thanks. How are you? Yeah, not too bad, thank you. Really, not too bad at all. Right. So, okay. Well, welcome back to the channel, everyone. Um, Indeed. Welcome back to Corby, our uh, multiplayer survival thing, whatever the survival aspect is, we just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So this is probably the last episode of the bulk recording we're doing. We should, after this one, we should now be able to respond to comments or respond in the game to the comments that you put uh, a little yeah. bit better. And uh, but yeah, so I hope you're all enjoying the series and thank you all for the uh, likes and the comments and everything like that. It's been, it's good to see. So this Massively episode, appreciated. it is, yeah. So this episode, we've got a lot to do. There's a sorghum field down there, which we're going to get harvested. I'm going to get the course play off doing that the other field that we just bought in the new plot or created in the new plot we're going to get well gray man's going to get the bales off that eventually and um i'll start marking it out for our new field and gray man's also going to be doing something with the old canola field i think it was yeah it was canola yeah in the last episode yeah but we're going to get some new kit to help us with that because our uh, current lime spreading solution is a little bit small for the game now so yeah so i'm gonna gonna invest invest in a new new bit of kit indeed so i'm gonna run this off to the shop quickly so i'm probably just gonna see everybody when i get there then we'll get a new bit of equipment ready for uh, getting the field turned around did you did you empty it i can't see any any line lying around i kind of didn't see the point to empty it to honest because okay. I'm going to load it back into the new one anyway, aren't I? Oh, that's true, yeah. So, Just do it um, down there. To be honest with you, there's no point in doing a jump cut now because I'm pretty much at the shop because this voucher is rapid. Yeah. So let's hopefully, this time I don't mess up because in the last recording we did, I kind of accidentally sold the tractor. Yeah. So this You're is, not having much luck with that voucher, are you? This is take two, isn't it? it oh, is, no, yeah. wait a minute. That's going to be 2-0 now, isn't it? No, no, no. We have, you, if we're honest, keeping score on who goes into the water. That's all. Okay, that's fine. Right. All I was doing was repairing stuff, and I know what I did. I went a bit too quick happy. So when I sold the um, fertilizer spreader, I went a bit quick happy. Yeah. Right, we still have a voucher, so that's good. Oh, that's good. Good, that's good, good, good. Right, so we're going to buy... If we're are we right, we're gonna buy the Amazoni ZGB six thousand and one six thousand liter. Yeah, I know it has got uh, it's got the same working width, but it has got a much bigger capacity, and it can do lime and also it can do um, fertilizer. I don't know what I don't know what type one type two does. That's my only thing. Uh, ooh. Doesn't seem to no, make a difference. Oh, I know what it does. It's to do with the hitch, is it? No, it's to do with the inside. So I don't really see the oh, point. Oh, so it's like a it... little mesh grate, isn't there, or something? Yeah, so you can have it normal mesh grate, um, triangular feed pod, or just as it is. I think to save ourselves some money, just leave it as it is. Yeah, because we put... are absolutely skinned at the moment, aren't we? Yeah, I will put a cover on it, though. <laughs> okay, yeah, I agree. Um, but I'm going to go a bit less orange. Because the orange is a bit orange for me. So that's 23,000. Is that okay? That's fine. Yeah, just. Uh, right. Well, you've done 6, it, haven't 000. you? So. <laughs> Didn't have much say in that. Well, you said you wanted a new one, so. Yeah, no, it's a good Before anybody spreader. says anything, I know I am. I know I have got the um, wrong front loader on this tractor. But this one has the, this front loader had the uh, forks on, so kind of made sense. So go this side. Ooh. Blocked by an object already. Blocked by an object. Yeah, of course, really? I can't even see my combine. It's vanished. <laughs> oh god! It's gone. I don't know that's where it's not, at. That's not good. It's, this it's is not, not in gonna... the field. 
Where is it? <sighs> oh, I can see it. I can see it. It's gone into Where the trees. It? Oh. What have you How been doing has it with it? How ended up in there? I don't know. I tell you what, it looks like for once you're babysitting the kids. Oh god. I don't do Cause kids. Because last, last time I was babysitting the kids. <laughs> yeah, you were. And it was a ruddy nightmare. All my episode was was chopping and changing, running around, looking after the kids. Yeah. So I'm gonna try and grab these. So I will see everybody back. Let me just have a look and see where the start point is of this. Uh... Where's the start point? I can't see it. I'm doing, I'm, I'm having about right, as good time as you, there. I think. It's over there. Right, okay. I'm crashing into everything, so that's going well. Let's, so uh... I'm going to get, I'm going to get my stuff back to. I'm going to get my stuff back to the uh, field and get some yeah. liming started. I think. Right, so uh, how is Crash Play getting on? Crash Play is, uh, I've nearly, I've nearly got it started. I'm just getting it to its start point itself. Okay, that sounds good. Hopefully, fun. hopefully that'll be us done. Right, I've got the fur spreader back to the farm. I'm just going to offload this uh, okay. fertilising. I've got a bag of fertiliser I brought back with me from the shop and then at some point when I go back again to get the subsoil I'll bring the seed back as well. Does that kind of make sense then? And then we've got everything okay, back so from the shop. That should be it off now. It looks like it's on the right path. What is its problem? Um, I think just the route it decided to go to to get to the start point was through the forest. Oh. That's, that's always handy, isn't it? Yeah, it's really handy. So I'm just going to leave this trailer at the side here. Right, well... And I'll come back for it in a bit because I'm actually trapped. I should have reversed up. So the next job that I'm going to do today is, because we're going to be wanting to use cosplay on this canola field, or the old canola field, we need to change the boundary a bit, and we're actually going to put in a stone path, or a gravel path, along here. Uh, to get us to our next field and that way it'll kind of delete the field um, and then cosplay won't try and seed our our path yeah so well, I mean, that's hope... why I thought I'd start over here and get yeah. this cracked on so I'm so. going to get this sorted out and cracked on and I'll probably see everybody on the other side of the time lapse Right, on to the last bit now. So we've got 700 litres left. I've got a few little patches to do, but that's not too bad. I'm hoping now, though, I should probably be... I think I'm going to have to nick the Eich tractor probably, to do the seeding on this. Not sure, actually. No, but I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll probably... Um, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll put the seeder on this, I think, on the Valtra. So I think Mount is potentially loading up uh, pallets. I'm going to have a quick skip through though. Okay, loads of space left in that trailer, so that's good. So that's all very nice. Uh, we are going to run out of tractors though, I think, if we're not careful. But I'll set this going on the cedar though, because the sooner we can get this sorted, the better. Um, right, so... Oh, Mark's not doing too bad. Ooh. Oh, he's only doing two abreast. Okay. Right. Let's get this put over here, I think. 
We're going to use Coal Spade to do the seeding because it should work pretty well on that field, I'm hoping. And we shall have to see, won't we? Ooh, not doing very good reversing today. Don't tell Malk though. That's what I end up in the. Uh, he'll put me in the drink at the end of the episode somehow. Definitely need to get some sheds down somewhere. Right, there we go. It's done a good job, that Amazonia actually. Much better than the other one and I'm very impressed with it so uh, this needs filling up by the looks of it that's fertilizer any more seed don't think we have uh, Malk when you're down at the shop yeah could you bring the bag of seed back please I could yeah Although thank might you very be, much might be some time okay well I mean I'm going to set this off anyway. Okay. And then I don't really know. Well, yeah, I'm going to set this. Oh, oh no 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 no. Oof. Right, that's better. Still need to find a bridge back for this. We um, do. Oh, made it, made it, made it, made it. Right, okay. We've run out of tractors. Well, I can use the archer, can I? Go collect the bales. Yeah. So. Let me set up course play. What are we gonna what are we putting in here, Malk? Uh ooh. We're putting soybeans in, aren't we? Soybeans, yeah, we could do soybeans. Uh, so first waypoint, no course. Gonna do two headlands, smooth, clockwise. Generate close. And I'm gonna say start job. It won't use any fertilizer with soybeans. So that's one good thing. It's, yeah, it's off. So let's see how that goes. I'm going to see how we get on with the trailer because I'm going to take the, going to take the trailer off the ITRA, I think. And, uh, yeah, plenty of room in there. So I'm going to get cracked on and get a load of bales collected off of that other field. Then we can get subsoiling going. Ooh, can we make it around there with that crop destruction? Yes, we can. Woohoo. So everything's looking good. So I will get cracked on with getting them bales collected, taking them back to the shop, and uh, I'll see you when I've got more collected, I think. It makes a bit of sense, really, because nobody wants to see us going around collecting bales. It's not exactly the most interesting job in the world. So I shall uh, see you on the end. Right, so how are you getting on with your bales, Greenman? Uh okay, yeah, not not too bad. Um what I've got probably two more loads left. Oh, I'm on I, I did see you doing some interesting restacking of your trailer earlier, and it was absolutely hilarious. Yeah, I may exactly. add. I've actually just found another pallet down halfway Wee. down the hill that I've missed, so... More money. Can't remember that one falling off, but anyway... Right, yeah, so... I'll just, just going to take that down on the loader. Interestingly, I will say... Oh, I've got one, two, three, four... Oh, no. Okay, so there's three bells left in the field. Yeah. So... This is the second to last load, so I'm going to actually go hightail it down to the shop. I'm going to go slightly different way because we can now cut down the side of this other area yeah. now can't we yeah we don't have and to we're nearly kind of are to our to our shop the one thing i will say though is um yeah i know our first couple of plots had a lot of trees on but the <laughs> tree islands on our new plot i'm just saying are chuffing insane yeah. um I'm not really sure what we're going to do with that. I think if we're ever taking them tree islands out, I think we're just going to have to do what we did, what, six or seven episodes ago? Yeah, I mean, my only thing is, I'm wondering if we can use one of the sort of platinum expansions. You know, the big big yarders that you have in there that were to bring trees down the side of a hill. I wonder if we could set a yarder up from there to the sawmill and just drag them across the map. Could do. Um, I believe the trailer for the sorghum needs emptying, sir. Okay, I can do that. Is there a tractor Please. there or not? Or do I need to no, go No, I've, 
I've stolen the tractor, sorry to say. Okay, that's not a problem. Because I had to, because we've run out. I don't know, because it says needs to be unloaded on the courseway dialogue on my right hand side. Okay, so I'm guessing the trail is full and right. the combine can't do anything. The problem you'll have now though is if you move the trailer and put the combine, put it back in the field, the combine won't find it. Because you think? it's stupid. No, it's uh, what I had before in the last episode. Well, I could maybe start and stop the course play and then... Uh, yeah, it might work, yeah. It. That's not a bad yeah. idea. Um, I okay. mean, this field is cleared now. Right. I've got four bells to go and then do you want to potentially borrow this tractor then to start doing the marking out of the of the field? Do, yeah. yeah, so I think what we'll do is we'll I'll mark the edge out. We'll create a custom field, a bit like what I did with the, this field I'm in at the moment. Yeah. And then we can just get some workers to finish it off doing subsoiling because it is literally one of the most boring jobs in the world. So. True, true. Um, obviously, then we need to we need to keep a tractor free for obviously doing the um, well emptying the sorghum. Well, well, no, doing we can the, roll <laughs> doing in the rolling. So we're we're running out of tractors again. I'm telling you. Yeah, is there anything for sale? Seeing as we've got like uh, forty odd grand free. Uh, anything in the sale? Is under the voucher. Another Valtra. Literally, oh. there's another Valtra. Oh, amazing. Right, so I also just realised that our our grain mill doesn't hold that much, does it? So. Uh, no, oh, but we've got a silo now. But we've got a silo now, yeah. So Okay. Uh, so what do you think about getting it? How much is the Valtra? 42,000. I don't know how many hours it's got on it, though. 42,000. It's got um, 32.8 hours on it again, though. That's another high... Oh, the kids are crying, mate. The kids are crying. Look at them. <laughs> right, okay. Do a little uh, bit so of picking up the bales here. I was supposed uh, to be getting some more seed for you, wasn't I? Yeah, but then you didn't have a good time with you. I didn't. I got a little bit distracted with... Uh, you got a bit... Pallets. And you got a bit aggressive with them as you tried to restack them down the hill, so... It's a good job they don't get damaged. It really is, yeah. Uh, right, so I just picked up my mess that I created earlier. Okay. So one, two, three, four. Okay, so we've got five stacks plus three spare bales. Okay, that's good. So they're not too bad. So that'll probably be next episode. We'll get those in. So that's f so five stacks of eight. So that's forty bales. And how many extras? Do you say three? Uh, yeah. All right. Well, that's about what we had, isn't it, off this sorghum field? Didn't we have about forty something bales in total. Yeah, I think we had about forty-seven, forty-eight, didn't we? Hmm. So not bad, not bad at all. I think the fields are similar sizes. They're not exactly the same, but they're not bad at okay. all, really. Right. Let's see if so I can that's... get this thing to empty. Right. So bales are off the field, sir. That's very so good. do you want... Uh, I'm trying to think if that needs to be... I wonder how much is left on the course bay for those seeding. Uh, I'm just looking at it now and it's hardly anything. It's got maybe three strips left to do. Well, I'll tell you what then, I will I will drop this back off. I'll sort out that, that child uh -huh, of yep. course play. You sort out the... Um, sort out the combine, which yep. obviously you're doing now, aren't you? I'm just doing that now. Yeah. Do you want to? Uh, do you want to take this forward because it's got a loader on it? Yeah. I mean, I was just going to run the. To be honest with you, I was. Well, it's not even three oh, strips. Oh, you're going to run it? it down to the store. I was just going okay. to run the um, thingy seed drill straight down to the store. To be honest right, with you. Okay. But I was going to give you this tractor and put the subsoil on it. Yeah. No, that's a good idea. We'll do that. Because this one's got a bit more horsepower, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm just going to line this back up. Get this out of the way. Get the subsoil on. Pass it back to you. I'll set the weeder or the uh, seeder going again in a minute. I'll bring it down to the shop. Ooh, I still can't reverse at all today. And then uh, you can at least get that field mocked out. Get a, get one 
tractor on it, can't we? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Right, so that's that. Where is the subsoil? There it is. Right, looking good. I don't know what you want to do about that other Valtra. Right, so my only thing is that that's the one that you sold, isn't it? Yes, that is actually you're right. So, so that is actually is it... our old one, but it's not. So... Oh, no, it's not because it's not the same, same save game because I crashed the server out, so it didn't save. Oh, so it shouldn't be there then. Uh, no, it should, obviously the game's just put it in. Coincidentally, then. Uh, yeah, pretty much. So we can't have right. it. If we want to, I mean, do we want another voucher or do we want? I thought we'd probably save a bit more money for a bit more horsepower. Oh, okay. Really? Um, could we need something either just on or above the two hundred mark? Really, don't we? We do. That's a good point. Okay. Um, well, we'll leave, we'll leave it there. I mean, if we want, did we? If we did want to buy another tractor, we could go for something like the. Let's have a look. Uh, so you could go for something like the Renault Ares. 600 which has got 194 horsepower right that's only that... 57,000 mm. well, so we need we're going to need 50,000 for our uh, next production ah, okay and we also yeah and also once we've got that we need to probably save up for our next um combine. thingy as well don't we really yeah potentially save okay. up for our, our combine yeah. so i think yeah okay i think we'll leave the voucher there for now we've got one already okay um, right, well, I'm just going to make a start on marking out this field. Right, I'm going to so, get this down to the shop. I'm going to get this set back off, and I shall see everybody when I've finished yeah. the uh, field off, and then I'll set the course by worker off on rolling. Right, rolling has begun, so that's not going to take too long. Um, I'm going to check on the combine. Uh, that's going to be a fun... Has it unloaded again yet? Yes, definitely. Oh, there should be three, about well, 3,000 litres in that I emptied into it direct. Yes, there's now 6,900 odd. Okay. I didn't so actually we... do anything. I just I just put the field... I just put it at the side of the field again. Okay. Um, how are we getting on with the old productions? So we've got... Uh, we you... might need to oh, switch ooh, the saw, right. come on. No, you've, you've, I think you've switched it on, haven't you? Well, it's only got 759 litres in it. Has it? Yeah. Uh, okay. I don't know then. Oh, I don't is know it, why it would do that. It, oh, okay. All right, let's create a job. Okay, so there's a few little bits, but they're not actually in our field. So we'll just ignore so those. Done. Um, so let's open this up, 2.8 metres, we'll do four headlands. Um, smooth corners are good, generate that one. Right, let's... Get the log fork oh. on the Ford and get a weight on it. Okay, so I've got a little issue with the um, course play, saying it can't detect it. So I think what that is, is something to do with this prefer custom field. So if I select that as activated and go back in and create the job, do the same again. There we go. It's got it. So that oh, looks very good, pretty right? good, actually. Ooh, Start the job. I, yeah, I had that issue on uh, No Man's Land when I did it. Right, okay. That makes sense. And that looks like it's going to be doing a good job. Right jump back to the uh, the farm here that's the road right. I'm going I'm going to do a bit of painting then right um, on where we're going to be putting down this new production yeah that and that'll help me know which trees to take down I suppose well yeah and also um, I don't know one hoping but I was hoping it would also help us are we just gonna pick them up yeah we'll just kind try of. and put full trees in um really we need to get that winch so we can drag them in 
Yeah, could do. Next time when we clear this path, I think that's a good idea. Yeah. So, um, let's just do around here, I think. I think it up to this clearing there, you know, where you've made. Probably where we need to be. Okay. It's going to be easy once we get these clear trees cleared, so I'll jump in the tractor in a second, I think. And Yeah, if you can start loading up. Oh, we could, do you think we're going to be able to actually pick these trees up in one go? I don't know. Does it cost us, Does it? do we lose anything if we haven't delimbed them? I think somebody in my comments had seen a video where someone had tested this out and the change in the amount of uh, wood that you got, depending on the length, was like, absolutely negligible. So it might yeah, just I mean, be... Oh, it was a melt wet. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> it was just so little it probably wasn't even you know it's probably just part of the game just being being the game the game does do rounding up and rounding down doesn't it yeah it does yeah not in a good way either because sometimes it loses stuff doesn't it sometimes yeah Ooh, went off so, course there right we'll get this first one in right I'm going to take this to a bit of a time lapse yeah to get these bits of wood loaded up because they're probably going to be quite comical and then we'll uh, we'll see how much wood we've got to put through the mill and we'll go from there right now that's looking yeah kind of pretty bare again yeah that's um, what happens definitely one way of loading trees up I must admit I'm not sure it's the best way not to completely break your tractor um, okay. but yeah Get in there. It'll be interesting to see how much wood's here actually in a minute. I've oh, got one more to do, haven't I? Behind? Yeah, Let's just the one, yeah. Yeah, and that should be right. Then we need to get a stump grinder out, don't we? Get these ground down and probably do a little bit more painting just to make it match. And then I think as the, ne as the next couple of episodes crack on, you know, I think we'll probably need this cleared all of that area cleared and we can have a clear area to either put some more productions or at least build an early farmyard yeah oh i didn't realize this was as big as that i <laughs> know yeah I, I i tried to pick it up and then realized how big it was oh, that didn't go well okay uh that's not gone well how are the kids doing by the way so the subsoil is going pretty well at the moment seems to be making a nice little path and oh, the rolling. The, oh, the rolling. Never thought to look. It's still moving. Uh, yeah. And I'd say the combine's about two thirds done. Okay. Right. So, let me just drop this off a minute. Okay. Go for it. Go for it. 21,300 litres. Wow. That's actually more yeah. than I thought there would be. Yeah, so do you want to get the stump grinder out and get rid of these stumps? Yeah, on the way, so I'm just going to take the front loader off. I don't need it anymore. No. It's just easier to take it off, and then I can take the front back weight off and put the... Oh, uh, yeah, it should work on this, shouldn't it? Okay. Where is the stump grinder? Uh, it's somewhere up there. I think I can see it. Okay, I'm just going to take this back weight off, and then I'll put it on. Yeah. So, uh... Uh, well, there it is. Yeah. Oh, so here's oh, no. our spreader. I haven't, I haven't been able to see that yet. Yeah, it's nice. It does a good it job. Nice. It does, yeah. Nice model as well. And obviously, it is off Mod Hub. Um, there's not that many spreaders on Mod Hub, actually. So. Right, reverse driving again. Hey, first one's down. Second one's down. Are we going to win it? This is. Third um, one's Third one's this is going really well. Fourth one. No. I did leave them quite. Oh, I did leave them quite long just to make them easier to find. But obviously, yeah, painting think... the texture over it is. Uh... Yeah, well, painting the texture makes a big difference. Can you do me another favour? You know that on our track. Yeah. We've got that this. tiny one bushel of weed. It's bugging <laughs> living nuts off me. Okay. Could you do me a favour? Can you just? I tell you what, do you want to put a do you want to put a gravel track in? Along here? Yeah, go on. You know you want okay. to. Yeah, I do. Of course I do. 
and then we can uh, tie it in with a bit more because we can probably put some more gravel down in some other places. I mean, not like we haven't really got enough money though, is it? No, we're doing all right. And we have got them bales to sell. Ooh, it's... Oh, combine needs the trailer unloading by the looks of it. So this is weird. It's actually dragging some forest texture with it. Oh, when you do the gravel? Yeah. I don't know if that's because it is either on forest ground or it's because it is on the edge of forest. It is on the edge of a okay. forest texture. So possibly. Right. That should be all of them, sir. Right. Well, I'll just finish doing this painting. Right. Once that done. Every episode we keep getting a bit closer and closer to putting something in. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a bit weird this one. I've never... Oh, I'm going to go get this trailer then. Right, okay. So you want did the you, bakery did you put, put in? Yeah, do you put sorghum? Right, you jump. You dump the sorghum in there. Oh, I know what you did. You didn't get it lined up right on the mill. And it stopped loading, didn't it? And you went, oh, it's really small. Oh, so capacity. as it tipped, it actually moved the um, the tipping point thing, thing. Right, okay. Yeah, so I think you need to get it a little bit more squared up, else it doesn't okay. always fully tip. It seems to be yeah, a little I bit of a bug. It, I thought it emptied quite fast. Let me just yeah. put these uh, zone markers on so I can at least see. Right, are you putting the bakery the down? Right yeah, I'll put the bakery down. Are you coming over for it or...? Uh, I will do in a second, just give me a sec. Let me, okay. if you wait two seconds, I'm going to literally get this trailer unloaded. So I'm coming back to the, what I'll do, I'll put this straight into the mill, and then we may as well put that, we may as well activate the production and put it on distributing in a minute, haven't we? Yeah, definitely. Are we... With the flour that we've already got out, are we then going to put that straight into the bakery anyway and then just have bread coming out? Um, or do we use it as a bit of another cash injection? Yeah, boost? I think maybe we'll just keep hold of that because there's, there's plenty inside the grain mill anyway. There's 11,000, 11, isn't there? Yeah. So the, the only Rollins issue with put, well. putting this bakery where... I'm going to have to set it back quite a bit from the track because the spawn points are quite a way out well the spawn and the front point is uh, and the uh, delivery points quite at the front isn't it so I'm going to be setting it um, yeah it's not easy to do this so it would be sort of the peak of the roof of the uh, grain mill yeah would be in line with the sort of edge of the round edge of the silo so that's how far back it would be. Right, okay, Karaki. Yeah, it, it's like a lot of wasted space, it feels like. Well, we have got quite a lot of space to deal with. Okay. Um, and um, and it's annoying me slightly because I'm not going to be able to put it square with the, with the uh, sawmill. It's going to have to be rotated slightly to be in line with the path. Oh, Malkin is... Okay, well... Right. Are you ready? Are you there? Come on then. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm here. I hope you like this. It's definitely the bakery. There we go. Oh, that's all right. I don't yeah. see the issue with that. Yeah, that's fine right. for me. Spot on. Excellent. So, another production? Another production. We're yeah. absolutely flying now. So, are we going to set the... Let me go into productions. So, we'll set the it's... flower now to distribute it. Yeah, I think so. There we go. Um, and we've got 7,500 litres of pig food at the moment. That's pretty good. I'll have to knock the planks on, so we start making planks again. Yeah, I'm just going to do a bit of painting to fill this bit in here. Yeah, okay. Gonna... Right, I'll go and have a quick check of the uh, all the kids, see how they're getting on. I think they're going to write the roll wind's going really well, I think. To yeah. be honest with you. Yeah, so I did see it, and it did look like it was going pretty well. It's three quarters done I think so yeah. doing a bit oh, of, yeah. just doing a bit yeah, of painting around the back of the of the mill 
as well. So we could probably set the weeder off as well, though. Have we got a spare tract? <laughs> <laughs> no, we haven't. Uh, That's the other problem, isn't it? Yeah, the, the, uh, really got... the combines need emptied again. But it's got very little left to do. Okay. So I'll, I'll get that done. around here. So I'm just going to do some paint around the back of the mill and the back of the bakery. So we could potentially use this as another entrance and exit. At some point we're going to put... Yeah, we're going to do this track out. At some point we know we are. Make that a little bit nicer, best we can. I'm tempted to put this track in. Oh, it's going to cost quite a bit though. Don't tell Malk. There we go. Just put this track up to there. It's a bit better, I think. Not cost too much. Gets rid of some more of this awfulness. You put a track in, so I'm going to put okay. a track in now. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so I think I can probably just leave that um, trailer now in the field. I think there'll either be enough capacity to hold everything in the combine, or the combine will uh, have enough capacity for it all. Do you think we're at a, a good If the trailer then? gets full. Yeah. So I think I might just go and get the weeder on the Ford, and we'll see about getting the... Uh, Oh, look at this track. Just thought I'd put that in round there and round here. It makes a bit more sense. Don't know what we're going to do up there and what we're going to do with the sawmill. No, I don't yet. I thought it, it, we get in there with it. It looks a bit better. Yeah. You know, we've still got a lot to do and we don't know what we're doing with the rest of it. But we'll get there, I think. But it just looks a little bit better coming in and out of here now. So, okay. right, let's see what the kids are doing. So, the boys have got seven minutes. Wow, uh, the subsoil is going to be done in like 20 minutes, so that'll be done off camera. Yeah. Um, obviously, one of us is going to have to do stone picking next time, aren't we? <laughs> yeah, I think that's my job this time. Okay, so the roller has exactly 31 seconds. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to stop that. I'm going to finish this myself. Okay. Well, I'll then, set the, uh, the weeding off. If you set the weeding off, I'll get this done in all the corners. And then we'll probably say... If we've got, have we got the productions. Did you say you got the productions kicked off? Yeah, I know. I'll do. So is the flower now going into the bakery by default? Yeah. Oh, nice. That's good. Right. So, pretty good episode so far, I think. And um, I'm quite happy with our progress. Are you? Yeah, setting the weeder off. Yeah, the weeder's away. Let's say. It's not the oh, actually, I, didn't, I didn't check how much fuel you've got. Oh, you haven't got much fuel. Eh, that should be enough. We'll I wing think it. Be okay. Right, I'm just going to pick this up a minute. Any edges that it's missed? It's just one here. Let's try and get ahead. That didn't work. No, it did. Can I beat the course plate? I can. Yeah, so right. the, the combine's probably only got about another three strips left to do. That's good. So, we are thinking about extending this field as well at some point because we think we can yeah. extend it a bit more. We were Ooh, for... we were discussing about doing it in this episode, but we just thought it would be a little bit too much work for us, seeing as we'd have to stone pick it and everything at the end. So, yeah, we'll uh, we'll definitely extend it out into that area there. When it's right, um, okay. I mean, what we put here, we put soybeans, haven't we? Yeah, so it shouldn't be too yeah. bad. I mean, we've still, we've, yeah. we've still got some. We've got canola in this in the uh, silo, haven't we? We have, yeah. Oh, let's use our nice new tract. Look at that. We're getting some tra tracks in now, people. Oh, blocked by an object. Who is? I've n oh no, now it's not. I don't know. The kids are having I their usual. I think it fun. might have been the weeder catching up with you. Really. Ooh, Maybe. Oh, oversteered. Oh, up in the drink again. Shush you, shush. Maybe. 
honestly. Right. That's looking good, looking good. Right. I am going to get this back, and I think for this episode we're about... I think we're about there, really, aren't we? Yeah, we are. So we may as well leave the kids doing what they need to do. We've good progression again. I'm not sure we're going to put any more productions in for a while now, are we? I can't think of anything we urgently need right now. I mean, we are getting the most out of any of our cereal crops now, aren't we? Because of, yeah. obviously, flour going to bread. I mean, we really need to push now to save up for a bigger combine. So yeah. that'll be our next thing. Which, we're probably not far we'll away be. from it, really. When you think we've got those bales going to be ready in a couple of episodes, and then yeah. we've got some more planks here, which we could be able to sell. So Yeah, and we've obviously got... Yeah, pre- I think we're pretty close. Oh, you haven't kicked off... Oh, no, the flour's not going in there yet. Right, well, I think we're uh, pretty much done for this episode. So, thank you everyone for joining us. Hopefully, you're enjoying the you've enjoyed the episode. If you have, make sure to give it a like, subscribe to uh, both channels if you're new. Obviously, watch episode on both channels, and we both look forward to you joining us next time. Many thanks for watching. <laughs>